Okay, the next thing I'm going to show you guys how to do is to create an index page. The index page is what sort of basically is the main page or what locates the entire website. And so I have my page one open. So what I need you guys to do right now is first of all, this is I'm going to go to File, Edit the Microsoft Office Word. And now it opens up as a Word document. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to insert a frame. So this right here is called the Frames Toolbar. See these items here? I'm going to put a frame on the left side. So what that does is it opens up a new document and it orients it to the left side of the page. So now I'm going to change the background. Nice black color would be nice. And I'm going to insert some, uh, some word art. So I'll go down to Auto Shapes. And it's easier if you click on this side and add your Auto Shapes over here. So I'm going to go over here and add some ovals. I'm going to draw an oval. When I get down with the oval, I'm going to drag it over and put it on the other side of the page. Okay, so I'm going to grab the oval now. I'm going to move it over here, put it right here. And then I'm going <coughs> to copy that and I'm going to paste it. And these are going to be my, my links to my different pages, okay? So I've got three ovals. <coughs> and what's going to happen is each of these ovals is going to be a button that's going to take me to a different website. So if I can get these all organized here, the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to make each of these into a button. So let's put a nice name on here. So let's go to insert some word art going here. And we'll call this the menu. So we'll type M-E-N-U. Okay. That'll be nice. We'll put that at the very top of the page. It'll make a really nice looking uh, item right here. If you want to move this around, just go to the Layout button and click in front of Text. That way okay, well, you can put it where you want it. I'm going to move these down just a little bit. And then this one I'm going to call. This is going to be. It's going to orientate me to page one. So this will be my page one button. This will be page two, and this will be page three. Okay. So let's right click on that. Let's insert some word art. So let's go to uh, insert picture <coughs> word art. And let's find something that looks really nice here. And we'll type page one. Okay, got that done. So now we're going to take that now and make it a little smaller. Drag that and put it on the other file right down here. Got to format word art. You can't move them unless you put them in front or behind text. So now I can take this, put it right here. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to paste it again. I'm going to paste it again. Put it right here. Okay. And I'm going to change this one. I'm going to change the, the font. Actually, I'm going to change what it says, not the font. I'm going to change that to page 2. I'm going to change this one to page 3. Just double click on it and it will actually change it. Okay, now if you've got this right here, you're on the start to something fantastic. So uh, we're going to take a little break right here and we'll get right back to you. Okay, in our last episode, we uh, made this page right here called the frame page and now what we're going to do is we're going to save it as the index page so you go file save as and we're going to call this index spelled lowercase i n d e x okay and I'm going to save it or I've been saving everything else so I'm going to go to my documents so I'm going to go to my desktop I'm going to save this in the folder that I've been working on. Okay, so I'm going to just call it index. Now, see what's a single file web page is a mistake people make all the time when using Word. So make sure that you click on the web page one. Okay, it just says web page. That's what you want to use. And you're going to save this page. Okay.